My mate is a bad date. My love life is an absolute train wreck at the moment. <laughs> wait, sorry, can you just wait? <laughs> this isn't even the bad bit. <laughs> <gasps> How much food do I have in me? What are we gonna do? <laughs> On probably 95% of dates, we will end up going back to my house. <laughs> do I have to elaborate? I need to know, why is your mate a bad date? So Harriet's a bad date because she has absolutely no chat. She's quite shy, uh, so to compensate for that, she will get very drunk before the date. She gets drunk on dates? Yeah. She's very rude to her dates. She burps and farts. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> if I do fart on a date, I'll make sure it's silent, but then it usually smells really bad. <laughs> yeah, and I'll kind of, like, look around the bar like, who did that? <laughs> If we have these types of attitudes towards sex, it's not very progressive. Hey guys, I'm Maloney and welcome back to my channel. This just sounds really crazy. You need to tell me more about her. I got some videos. Okay. How's your day been? Yeah, yeah it was good. Just been looking forward to this. Yeah. Drink. <laughs> the drink? Yeah. That's what she's been looking forward oh, to. No. It's so rude. Usually on dates, I forget that people find burping really rude. <laughs> <laughs> wow, did she just burp? Yeah. One guy I went on a date with straight up said that was disgusting when I burped in his face. Not in his face. Well, I did blow it in his face after. <laughs> I've just got to be more to talk about. <laughs> She's run out of chat there. She really has run out of yeah. chat. She doesn't have anything to bring to the table. <laughs> there was one time before I knew I had like double vision. I was really drunk. You're drunk now! Yeah. I feel so bad for him. Yeah. I've heard enough. I need to meet your sister mm -hmm. immediately. Yeah. Because we really need to fix yeah. this. So Harriet, you've been nominated by your sister mm -hmm. as a bad data. <laughs> Tell me more about your dating life. Um, at the moment, there's not much happening in the past. I was going on dates like maybe two or three times a week. Okay. How many dates do you wait before you jump into this act? It's usually the first date. First date? Yeah. Thing. I mean, there's nothing wrong <laughs> with having sex on the first date if the connection is there, but sometimes it is good to wait. Yeah. Do you usually learn their last names? Um, sometimes I don't even know their first name. <laughs> Where are you finding these men that you're going out with? Mostly on dating apps and social media. Okay, well, you know what you need to do? Hand over your phone. Oh, it's bye. time for some digital <laughs> detoxing. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow. You've got a very artsy page. <laughs> I think my social media is a pretty decent insight into me as a person. I don't really hide anything. A lot of boob photos. Do you think you could be sending a mixed message when it's just your body and not your face? I don't know. I don't really post it with the intention of getting, like, male attention. Of course. It's more of, like, a feminist statement. Can we look at your DMs or not? Yeah, if you want. We've got John, Lawrence, Tom, Dominique, George, Christopher, Tom. You're not replying to any of these no. people. <laughs> I think if it's the right person, I would jump at the chance to reply, but I haven't yet felt that. But then again, how would you know if they're the right person if you're not giving them much of a oh chance? Oh, you're right again. <laughs> So I have some videos that were sent in to me about how you are on dates. What do you think they're going to say? Hopefully good things, You but... think they're going to be good? No. No, be honest. <laughs> yeah, so the time she married herself... Um, Wait. <laughs> Can we pause that? <laughs> you did what? You married yourself? <laughs> As in you said, I do, to mm -hmm. yourself. I, like, wrote some vows you... and everything. Seems good. Self-love yeah. is not bad. OK, let's watch the rest. <laughs> I walked her down the aisle to Beyonce and gave her away to herself. On the same night we went out and she cheated on herself with a guy, so... <laughs> yep, that's Harriet. <laughs> Turned out he had a girlfriend as well. He had a girlfriend. A oh, Harriet, <laughs> we've got a lot of work to do. <laughs> the burping, I mean, it's impressive, I'll give you that, but 
at the same time, I don't think it's really the kind of manner you want to expect from someone on a date, especially first date. She also, I think, she drank about five drinks. I think that was maybe a bit too much. That's not much. Five? That's nothing. Five? Yeah. The idea of going on a date sober is absolutely terrifying to me. I don't think I could do it. It seems like there's a pattern when it comes to your dating habits, and that's you wanting to be drunk yeah. and to be someone you're not. Now, if you want someone to like you for who you are, how are they going to see that if you're constantly wasted? Oh, no. Doesn't make sense, does it? <laughs> no, you're right. Again, you're always right. I know best. <laughs> I have never heard her say, I really like this guy, this is serious, we're, you know, been dating for a while or anything like that. There's never any sort of connection with any of them. She seems a bit of a closed book. She doesn't want to let anybody in and I can only imagine that's because she's worried about getting hurt. Wow, that was deep. How do you feel about that? That was very true. You think but, so? Yeah. That's a good analysis as mm. well. But I'm still confused within myself about where I stand with men and women and like trans and obviously like non-binary. Yeah. I am pansexual, but I've only ever dated cis men. And why is that? It's what I know and what I'm comfortable in. I don't really like going out of my comfort zones. The women in Portsmouth are really pretty yeah. and it's quite intimidating so I usually just stick to the men because I feel like that I could maybe have more of a chance with them. Would you be willing to date a woman? Yeah, of course. Okay. <laughs> I've got a challenge for you. Are you ready? Yeah. Now I'm going to put you on three dates. Oh my God. And on those three dates, you're going to cut back on the drinking. Actually, no but, drinking. No. Drinking, no drinking. <laughs> no you're going to try and start up a conversation, be your best so, okay. and there's gonna be absolutely no burping. I can do that. Can you do that? Yeah. Because listen, I've seen a side of you that I want those three guys to see. Okay. From a bad date to a good date. Are you ready? Yes. Are you sure? <laughs> yes. Let's do this. <laughs> Let's do it. So is this the sort of date she would ever go on? No, it's normally just um, pubbing. Usually people want to go to the cinema or go out to eat. Yeah. But if you do something fun, and again, brings out your competitive mm. side, could really give you something to talk about. Oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Struck oh my God, she's gorgeous. already started drinking. She started drinking. <laughs> <laughs> that lasted for like 0 0.5 seconds. Yeah. Hiya! Hi. You're Hi. right. I'm Harriet. I'm Kit Kaliva. <laughs> mm -hmm. He's not her usual type either. Like, yeah. okay, good. You're drinking as well. Yeah, don't worry. I wasn't gonna leave it alone. <laughs> I'm terrible at golf, so oh, oh. fucking out. <laughs> oh my god, she's already dropped the f bomb. Um, I mean, there's being yourself, and then there's being yourself. Mm. Uh, yep. <laughs> yeah. You got it. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh! No! <laughs> was... This is really good. I, I like seen... that we're starting to see this side yeah, of Harriet. Yeah. Yeah. She's bringing out that fun side that I really wanted to see. Um, a four. I feel like we've... Got my drink. That's yeah. ten. Is that me or...? <laughs> what I also find hilarious is that he's left his drink back there yeah. and she's holding on to hers for yeah, dear life. Dear life. <laughs> Um, I like drawing different things. I yeah. like drawing like with like, yeah, like cartoons, yeah. And things like that. Why doesn't she show her Instagram or something? Like then they could swap socials. Uh, but I haven't really drawn for a long time. No, how come? Swap Instagram. Okay, I need to call her. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> no, go ahead. Hello. Why don't you like get his Instagram so you can show him your art and you can stay in contact? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Yeah, I've got like a lot of my art on Instagram. Uh -huh. What about you? Do you have Instagram at all? Yes. Yeah? I've got, I've got Instagram, yeah. Can uh, I add you on it? Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, I really like, get back into it. You're real, you're arty art. Yeah. <laughs> and this is what we need the men she's dating to see. Mm. Yeah, that So, how long have you been single? Roughly two years. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, yourself? Like three and a half. How come you ended? I was young, uh -huh. so it was all a little bit. It was okay. Yeah. It was alright. I think we're friends now. That's so. good. I would never mention being friends with an ex on a first yeah, date. I wouldn't either. It's not a bad thing to talk about your ex, mm. but sometimes 
hold yeah. the back. It's been really lovely to meet yeah, you. Yeah, really nice to meet you too. Thank you right. for coming. Have a good day. Bye-bye. <laughs> so awkward. We're so bad at this. <laughs> Date one, done. She's had a drink, but she hasn't gone too crazy. There hasn't been any burping, farting of any sort. At this rate, Harriet is going to be a great date. I've put her on a brunch date because there's no boozing mm -hmm. that she can do early in the morning. Yeah. I'm hoping anyway. <laughs> Can't say yet. I think they serve beer, so we'll see. Hi. Hi, Hi you darling. You're all right. Good. How are you? Oh, you look very nice. You look amazing. I love the red. <laughs> she seems so much um, more at ease than uh, yesterday yeah. to me. <laughs> Yeah. I really do not know. <laughs> um, Can we do drinks? Man? Oh my god. <laughs> Can I just have like, a sparkling water? Oh <gasps> sparkling water. Oh, this is sparkling. Thank you. She's made my earring come out. Oh, no. <laughs> That's how shocked I am. <laughs> Hold my earrings. <laughs> Hold my earrings, for real. I think, so what, what's the key scene? Like, where you're from? Is it big? Non-existent. Like, really? Michelle's yeah. was really cute. I like yeah. her. No, she's lovely as well. So all the idea of, you know, women being intimidating, that's absolutely yeah. BS. I've never actually been on a date with a girl before. Have you not? No, this is my first one. <laughs> eee, I'm privileged. <laughs> oh, she's opening up, yeah. but in a nice, just, light way. Yes. I get so nervous before like dates, and I get like nervous poos. <laughs> wow, really? Yeah. I was like running to and fro, like how much poo do I have in me? <laughs> oh God, man. No, I need to give her a call now. I'm getting a call, sorry, sorry. No, that's fine. <laughs> Hello? Harriet, what are you playing at? <laughs> what happened to the bad manners that we spoke about? I thought it was okay to talk about this. You thought it was okay to talk about poo on a first date? On your okay. first date? Okay, I'll stop. Put sorry. that to rest, <laughs> but no one wants to know about your nervous poos, okay? <laughs> I certainly don't. Yes, ma'am. Change the topic. <laughs> talk about the weather if you have to. The weather? Right, okay. Bye. Okay, bye. <laughs> She's nervous. <laughs> sorry about that. These nails look so good, but they're just impractical for some things. These are dangerous though, you know, if, if, if you're a lesbian. Oh yeah, I know. <laughs> you need to get rid of the two. Just get rid of the two? <laughs> well, that would look a bit suspicious, wouldn't it? So how do you spot a lesbian? Well. <laughs> Phoebe, what are we going to do? God, what type of guy would you go for though? Indie, like artsy types, mm. those ones. Talk about your taste in women. Why are we making mm. this so male-focused? Yeah. Like, I love a guy in a suit. Oh my God, it kills me. And what about a girl? Suit. And a girl in a suit. Okay, there we go. There we mm. go. It's such a strong look. <laughs> I look so funny in them, though, because I'm so short. <laughs> Don't be daft. Oh, I've had such a good time. Yeah. yeah. It's been really lovely to meet you. So it's a very nice uh, first girl, first date. Yeah, it's, yeah. I'll definitely remember it, because you're so lovely. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you as well. It's been really nice. I'm so happy with how date two has gone. Yes, there's been talk about poo, but you know what? She hasn't farted, she hasn't burped. There is still a bit of work that needs to be done, but so far, I'm pleased. <laughs> So Harriet, this is your third date. Yeah. You're gonna be in a gallery. I really wanna see the bubbly side of you. Understandably, there might be some awkward silences, but this is where you have to try and give your best when it comes to having a conversation. Do you think you can do that for me? Yes. You can? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, uh, nice to meet you. I'm going. Lovely to meet you. Me too. No, he is so good looking. He is so gorgeous. Yeah. Should we have a look around? Yeah, that's it, yeah. <laughs> this is I reckon, I reckon he's, di he's diving into the water. <laughs> what do you do for a hobby or not? Um, I like getting drunk. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. yeah. So you're looking for love, <laughs> romance, <laughs> yeah. marriage, kids? No, 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 no. I don't want to get married. No. I don't want kids. No. I just want, like, to settle down. Okay. <laughs> It's weird, what does it like, mean? It? <laughs> what is that? What's going on? I think it's someone's house. <laughs> I want her to ask him more questions. Yeah, definitely. Like, there's nothing wrong 
you know, talking about the art, but mm -hmm. it should lead to her other parts of conversations that she can have with him. Oh no. <laughs> Hello? Well, let's see you ask him more questions. So how about you ask him, like, when was the last time he was in a relationship or how long he's been single for? Can you do that okay. for me? Yeah, sure. Bye. Is that mommy again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, when are you home for tea? <laughs> yeah, how long have you been single? Um, about a year, actually. Yeah? Yeah, what about yourself? Three. Three years. Here we go, her chat's getting better. So how often do you work out? Ooh, I like this. Um, every day, practically. Every day? Yeah. She's always looking for excuses to get back in the gym. Really? So maybe he could be her motivation. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I tried doing Zumba in my bedroom and all yeah. I was just like bumping into yeah. everything. I feel like she's becoming a better data. Mm -hmm. I think her chat is definitely improving. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna burp. Sorry. <laughs> Very ladylike. <laughs> Did you burp? Yes, and he heard it as well. No. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's been lovely to meet you. Yeah, you too. Oh. <laughs> and shake and a hug. <laughs> okay, see you later. You see the bit. Bye -bye. Take care. Have a good day. You do. This was date three, and I had such high hopes for Harriet because it seemed like she was doing so well, and it turns out she was burping too. So Phoebe, you nominated Harriet as a bad date. I've gotten feedback from three of the people she went on a date yes. with. Oh my God. Let's see what they have to say. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so, here's a crazy golf date. She made a lot of jokes. She probably hid her nervousness through the jokes she was making. That was, I kind of picked up on that. I feel like I was nervous giggling quite a lot. Yeah. Which is true. She kept it interesting. Um, She's got a good competitive edge when it comes to mini golf. She's really good. You know, she made it fun. Ah, oh, yeah! Oh, yeah. Oh, I was kind of expecting that. Now let's watch the brunch date. Harriet was really easy to talk to. Um, she was fun. She was bubbly. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, bless her. I was expecting Harriet to be a bit more classy. I was a little bit gutted when she started mentioning poo and things like that. <laughs> What are you thinking about talking about poo? No, I don't know. I panic. So now we have date number three. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she seemed cool. She was laid back, so yeah, there's nothing fake about her. She kept it real. Okay. Yeah, it's not bad. Enough. It's good. It's giving you major points there. Apart from the burping. I didn't think he'd notice the burp, to be fair. But what were you thinking? He called me out straight away. <laughs> After everything, Phoebe, do you think your mate is a good or bad date? I think she is now a good date. Yay! After all of your advice. <laughs> what about you, Harriet? What do you think? I think I'm a good date. Right, that's great. Let's see what they have to say. I think she's a good date. Hey! <laughs> I think Harriet is a really good date. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Now we have your last date, which is a gallery. I reckon he's going to say bad date. Why do you think he'll say bad date? Because of the burp. <laughs> All right, let's watch. Yeah, I think um, Harriet is a good date. <laughs> You're so wow. sure. Wow. <laughs> Sure. Wow. <laughs> That's three out of three. How are you oh, feeling? Yeah. Full house. Yeah, I feel good. I'm going to go home and go dates every night. <laughs> oh, you're not going to ghost anyone? No. <laughs> you won't go no, silly no, one. No. There won't be any more burping. Mm -hmm. And I'm hoping you'll take on more of the tips that I've given you because mm -hmm. it looks like you really can do it. Yeah, I'll be married by next month. <laughs> <laughs>